Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech Ed. In today's video, I want to show you guys how to sign and annotate PDF documents on your Samsung Galaxy smartphone. So you can do this on any Samsung Galaxy phone with or without the S Pen and it is 100% free. You do not need to download third-party apps to get this done. All right, so to get this done, what you want to do is you want to go to your Samsung Notes application. All right, so launch the Notes application and then go right inside. You're gonna be at the main screen right here. Now let's say somebody emailed you a PDF file and you downloaded that to your smartphone. The next step is gonna be, all you do is you tap on the PDF plus icon right here, okay? Let me just grab the S Pen, it's gonna be right over here. It is the import PDF icon. Now when you click on it, it is gonna allow you to go into your storage and select the file that you downloaded to your phone. So I'm gonna to go to my downloads folder where I have a sample contract. So I'm gonna tap on it and here's the contract. I'm gonna select that, I'm gonna tap on done. Now that's gonna import the contract into my Samsung Notes application. So first I'm gonna show you guys how to use the pen and then I'm gonna show you guys how to use your finger if your phone doesn't have an S Pen. So first, you just scroll down to where you want to sign, okay? I'm going to go all the way down. Let's say you're the person that's going to be approving this contract. It's going to be right here, so that's where you want to sign. So first, you're going to tap on this icon right here, which is going to allow you to bring S Pen tools, so you can select the pen size, pen color, pen type, whatever you need. Let's just stick to this size. Let's say you want to do blue. Of course, the usual is the norm is black. So let's just go with the black, and then all you do is you sign it. So blah, 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 and you are in fact good to go. Now, after you have signed, you wanna send the contract back to the person or the document back to the person that sent it to you. So then what you do is you go to the top right here and you tap on it, and what you wanna do is you want to save as file. So when you tap on save as file, you have the option to save it as a PDF file, a Microsoft Word file, an image file, text file, PowerPoint, or a Samsung Note file. So mostly people go with the PDF, you tap on it, and you simply select a location to save it. I'm just gonna say my download folder. I'm gonna tap on done, and you can see it's gonna ask you to put a name. Let's just say signed contract, all right, and you save it, that's it. Now you can launch your email, uh, and you can attach this file to send it back to the person. Now, if you wanna annotate the document, you just use the highlighter tool, which is right here. That's tap on that one, and then again, tap it again, and you can choose which highlighter you want to use. Select a color, let's just do red, so we can see it easy. And then you can also change the intensity. Uh, let's go over here, okay? And basically, you go anywhere you want, and you just highlight what you wanna uh, highlight. By the way, look at this. Depending on where you start, you can see I can make it straight. So it actually snaps into place when you come to like vertical or horizontal. So you can do very clear highlighting. If you wanna do freestyle highlighting, you go to the first pen, which is this one right here, okay? With this one, you can just do freestyle highlighting as you please. No problem, and I did forget to mention, when you tap right over here, if you just wanna share this file right away without saving it, you can go down just a little bit more and simply tap on share, and that's gonna allow you to bring up your email, text message, whatever you need, and just share it right from here. So you can save the file and attach it later, or you can share it right away, and it's gonna attach it for you once you select where you wanna send it. All right, now let's move on and talk about how you can do the same thing with your finger if you don't have the S Pen because it is a little tricky. But again, you go to the main screen, you tap on the PDF with your finger, you go to downloads, and then you grab the contract, okay? So we're gonna do the same contract. Now here's the crazy thing with this one. You can see I can use my finger to swipe around. When I come down to the area that I wanna sign in on, I first I zoom in where I wanna sign in, and if I tap on the icon here for sketching and select a pen, look at what happens. Okay, let's just say 42, let's say red color. As I try to sign, it's just gonna move the screen around. That is because you do have to tap on the icon here and turn on finger drawing. So when I tap on that one, now look at what happens. It is not moving 
it actually is giving me the finger on mode. Now, tap this again to turn off the finger mode, and now I can move it around. Perfect, okay? And again, with annotation, let's say I want to annotate this area, okay, or whatever you want. If you tap on keyboard, it goes to keyboard, but if you tap on the sketch icon, it goes to sketch mode. So I'm going to go to my highlighter, I'm going to choose the freestyle highlighter, and look at this. When I try to do it, it's moving around. Again, tap here and turn on finger drawing, and now I can annotate whatever I want. And if you want precision annotation, you go to this pen, and like we said, that will give you precise annotation. When you're done, turn off the finger mode, and then you can move around, and then when you're ready, you simply save or you share. And that's it, guys. Very simple, but a lot of people do not know how to use this, and also it is 100% free. Do not buy an application to get this done. All right, any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below. Let me know for now, guys. Have a fantastic day.